there are a lot of articles out there relating um, coffee as a good food for the lungs. But why so? We need to really start understanding the energetic aspects of lungs and especially, you know, um, very often I hear a lot of people saying that if a person has asthma, then, um, you know, increasing, uh, having a little coffee actually helps them. But we need to understand the mechanism. The general state of asthma is such that there is a lot of inflammation and sensitivity happening in our body and in our lungs. However, at the time of asthmatic attack, it is the exact opposite in the sense that instead of an over relaxed, expanded to the degree of weakened system, there is a certain contraction happening. And that contraction is what we call as, you know, um, an asthma attack. Now, at the moment of that attack, we definitely need to open out that contraction with something that expands. But it needs to be things that gently expand your body or things that help in general. So this is to explain because coffee is considered a relaxant and coffee is, uh, you know, will obviously relax the muscles in the moment. Sure, it's used as, you know, a remedy, as a quick remedy for um, an asthma attack but we can't take that you know so much further and say that coffee is good for lung health because if we have coffee on a regular basis coffee will um, uh, you know create a lot more inflammation uh, internal swelling acidic blood leeches minerals out of the body it does a lot of harmful things which are not actually good for lung health so um, we need to bring more awareness about the energetic aspects, about the different stages of diseases, what is a long stay disease, what is a disease at the time of attack and how do we, or at the time of a sensitivity or a flare up and how do we help improve that.